So I'm Josh Morgerman and uh, I'm a hurricane chaser. I chase under the brand name iCyclone. And uh, chasing for me, uh, initially for most of my life, it was about uh, sort of thrill seeking. And uh, now it's become more about truth seeking, about uh, collecting data in storms that are coming ashore in very remote areas to kind of help fill the gap in terms of solving the mysteries of what happens in these storms when they come ashore. And today my, uh, my presentation was about Hurricane Patricia in Jalisco, Mexico, which was a perfect subject for me because it was a very intense hurricane that came ashore in a very remote region. And uh, the data I was able to collect inside that storm was very uh, scientifically meaningful. Yeah, that's interesting. Um... So you've done uh, several uh, chases like this in the past. Uh, could you uh, like name a couple of them? Yeah, I would say Patricia's up there for me. It's, it's one of my top chases in terms of just like the intensity of the storm and what I saw. Um, I would say Hurricane Patricia is one. Super Typhoon High End in the Philippines is another. That was a Category 5 typhoon, and I was in the northern eye wall of that and, again, collected some incredible data and, and unfortunately saw incredible destruction as well. And then another big one was Hurricane Dean, another Category 5 on the Yucatan Peninsula. I chased that one in Chetumal, a uh, small Mexican city. So those are some of my most memorable chases. But I think Patricia might might edge out those other ones. It was really one of the most incredible experiences of my life and my career. Wow. Okay. Um, how, uh, you know, you, you say you go through, uh, go to like the center of these hurricanes a lot. How concerned are you with your safety during these? What kind of um, precautions do you take to make sure you are safe and your chase partners and people with you are safe? You know, it's a great question. You know, the safety is always a concern. And because I like to chase the really, really intense storms and because they're often hitting areas that are very remote or don't have great infrastructure, I worry about safety all the time. You know, and as I talked about in my presentation, you know, I, I, I'm scared of these storms. You know, just like anyone, I'm not a fool. Of course I'm scared when I'm chasing a Cat 5. But my curiosity about about what it's going to be like inside and what kind of data I'm going to collect, that curiosity outweighs my fear. And, and I, I set a terrible example when I say this, but I'm, I'm, I'm more about getting those data inside it than actually worrying about my safety. And that's probably a horrible thing to say, but I do try to take precautions once I'm in the storm.